Hi everyone, it's Rina, and today I am playing the final part of At Home Alone. So I did try the second one, but it's literally the same exact version of the first one, and they just upgraded the art style. Um, so I'm here's hoping, here's hoping that this one isn't the same kind of rendition, because it didn't give you any detail or information to what changed. There we go. The story is fiction and contains games uh, to whatever characters. There's uh, violence in this game. Beware, okay? So that's the guy who's in the news. Head hurts. Where is it? This is how the second one started off. Oh, wow. And they added little... So they keep adding little tiny, 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 tiny details changed okay you're staying home well don't go outside cool okay thanks mom bye mom okay we're gonna go upstairs first we probably have the same things i'm probably gonna speed through a lot of this and if anything's interesting i will let you know okay diary is still the same can't read it it's probably gonna be the same thing I'm pretty sure it's gonna be the same numbers as before um, so for you guys if you didn't know in the first game if you came right here in between the two doors there's this like area and you can put in a code but it obviously it was kind of hard to know that that even existed because there's no like visual feedback about that bathroom they add this in the second game <laughs> This is the definition of that you know you're bored when. <laughs> oh! Oh! Did you see that? My shadow left the room. It's creepy. I'm a little crow. Everything is the same. So weird, why is there no one? Who rang the doorbell? Oh, what do you know? It's that kid again. Someone is at the door of the gate. What are you doing here? Oh, yeah, I forgot. There's like a whole actual facial display. Now we can know what he looks like. Cool. So weird. What's wrong? I don't know. I just feel strange. What makes you feel strange? I don't know. Hmm. You really are weird. Would you like to come in and play with me? I wouldn't. <laughs> That's a good answer. It's a good answer. There's no one at home. I'm so bored at home playing. Come on. Well, he's going to get persuaded by the cake. Let's treat you to the cake. Cake? Oh, God. He hasn't eaten, has he? Yes. See, what he should have done and been like, just play here. He's this would have been safer if you just played right here. But whatever. Wow. Follow me. See, this time I don't have to do this. It's not me. So my hands are up here. Okay. Come on in. And try the cake. Yes, it's really big, soft coffee, chairs, I know, amazing. What do you want to play? Um, not hide and seek, that's for sure. Uh, we are going to... First, let me fulfill our agreement of the cake. I'll sit, you sit here and I'll get you some cake. Perfect, right? I know, let's go. It's literally the same thing. Nothing is different. Still no one. Weird, huh? So strange. Wow, it's that older kid. The older brother. He must be playing a prank. What a bad guy. How dare he? I'm going to play a prank on him and go down the street and pick up this ice cream and throw it at him. 
This is my ice cream from before. Hey, look, it's my crow. Oh, how did he do that? Okay, fine. I'll talk to him. <sighs> what? Oh, look how cute he is. I wouldn't do such a thing. What are you doing? Do you see a boy with red hair? I'm looking for him everywhere. I did. He's in my house. Why is he in your house? I invited him to play there. Why did he call you that? It's like, little girl, you're gonna take me to find him. I have to call him back. No problem. I guess it's better than calling me little girl, but whatever. I think that's what they called me in the first one. Come with a me. Okay, senpai, let's go. Kangta. Where is he? Hey, it's weird. He just sat on the sofa and ate. Where did he go? Kanta, answer if you hear. Uh, I hate the English in this. <laughs> Time to go home. Okay. <gasps> Did he go upstairs? Well, you go upstairs and look for him first. I'll go and find out who's outside. Okay. Go outside and find out who it is. Let's see this blonde haired girl and her little cute puppy outside. They are trying to fool me. Oh my god, it's the little blonde girl from my diary. Oh, I forgot I was controlling that. What a cute dog! It's a chihuahua, so cute. What's the name? They change the name each time. <laughs> Dudong. Oh, look at him. It's so cute. Little black beady eyes. Can you play with me? Can I play with your dog? Come to my house with your dog. I'm so bored at home unless I have your dog. <laughs> huh? Uh, really? Yeah, if you come, it'll be very interesting if you're as long as your dog is there come on you mean and your dog if you have your dog there it'll be great okay is that okay yes yes it is okay just for a little while it's fine all right i'll play with you for a while so grateful follow me and your dog oh, perfect You ready? You ready for a good time? You're breaking the agreement. Is there some way I can possibly bring her in? That's what I want to know. Is there some way? Oh, ooh, he doesn't seem so happy. Um, I know it's not going to let me do anything, so let her leave next time. I'm so sorry. I'll just pass by. He looks so mad. Come back. No. <laughs> I just wanted to play with your dog. Oh, it, it, I don't know what it said. That was way too fast. I accidentally clicked it. What if I chase after her? Mr. Crow. <gasps> oh, I missed my chance. Let's go into my house. It's gonna be a great day. Great day to kill someone. I mean, just in case. Huh. Strange. Such a loud sound. Oh. Music's different. Hello? Anyone? I'm wasting time. I already know that they're where they are. Can I go in my bathroom? How about in my mom's room? Still locked, huh? Ah! 
What did you do? Aw, you seem so upset. Huh. So strange. So strange. Oh. Okay, so this is interesting. So we finished the full first part, and now we're the redhead kid, I guess? Finally. I found you. Hope it works this time. Oh! It hurts. How can't... How can't I get... How come I can't get through is what they meant to say. No. Damn it. It must be it. That bastard. So close. Hmm. Now what? Finally! Yay! Oh, something flickered that looked like a crow face. Oh, mom's face is gone. Didn't she have eyes last time? Mom, something's wrong with your face. Could have sworn she had eyes. Huh. Whether or not skip or repeat content. We're gonna skip the repeated content. Go straight to the point. I don't know. Weird. You're really cute. I mean, uh, where did he go? Um, I don't, I really don't know. Huh, she's, huh, my inside voice kind of came out. Maybe we should go look for him. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't go home so I can just stare at your face. I mean, I think I heard him. I think he's upstairs. We should go up there. Yeah, yep. Mm hmm You can go upstairs and look for him first, or go upstairs and have a look together. I mean, if I get to see his face longer. I mean, yeah, we'll go upstairs together. <laughs> okay, let's let's do this. Let's ignore the girl, because she won't let me take her inside anyways. For some reason, she doesn't want to come in. Uh, the door is locked. Are you inside? Answer if you are there. It's time to go home. How long are you going to play? As long as you're there, you can stay forever. I mean, yeah, how long are you going to be hiding in my room for? Jeez. Um, let me go get the keys. You stay right there. <laughs> Sorry to bother you. It's not a bother. Okay, anyways, let me go get those keys. <laughs> Whoops, there we go. Let's see if I can get in mom's room. That has been my mission this whole entire time. Hey, you wait just a moment. There's no way he's hiding inside. What if I want to go inside? I want to see what mom's room's hiding. Here you go. Can I have the keys, though? I really would like you to see my room. I mean, I'd really want to see inside mom's room. <laughs> I mean, you can keep looking for him, or you can come sit on my bed and we can just chat. Oh, what was that noise? I don't know. Oh my gosh. No. It can't be. There's a pool of blood on the ground. How could it be? I don't know. That's really strange. I really don't understand. Why there's so much blood leaking. Oh my god. I don't know. Why? Oh my god. Oh my god. Cacto. Oh. Uh -huh. 
now that he's out of the picture, should we go and talk about this in private somewhere else? You know, I could be your... We could share a little relationship of... Uh, sadness. Damn it, it's still blocked, huh? That's not me doing that, by the way. See, it's still, still not me. Still not me. Get out of the way. <sighs> okay, you might have asthma, my guy. Oh, you are forcing it. What's going on? I don't know. This is all new to me. Finally! Some new stuff. Mom, your face. It's still missing. The rest of your face. Like you have hair, but no face. Okay, bye. Hmm. Maybe we should go out of our room. <laughs> yes, we're gonna skip. I got the cake. Oh, see, that's that's a nice skip. In the second one, you you still have to go through that conversation. And then grab the cakes. This is a nice skip. Wow. Thank you. Huh. I mean, we should probably go out and play after eating. Unless it's going to be your brother. I mean, yeah, let's go to that interesting place where we can play there. What interesting place? You know when you go. If you go. You know if you go. Wait for me. Let me finish. Yeah, you keep eating. Get you nice, fat, and juicy, plumped up. What kind of crap did she put in this cake? Let's go! Alozi! <laughs> Where is it? Just follow me! What's going on? What's... Hey, my brother seems to be calling for me. Is he? Is he calling for me? <laughs> or, I mean, I think you're just hearing things. Did you get it wrong? I didn't hear anything. Really? I heard it. I think he was calling for me, not you. It seems a little similar. Sounds a little similar. I think you're hearing things. He definitely was calling for me, not you. You want to play hide and seek? But we don't have enough people. It'll be fun to have more. Maybe I can go... No. Hide and seek? We ain't doing that. See those butterflies up there? There's three of them. We're going to play hide and seek with those. Okay? They're going to hide and you're going to close your eyes and then you're going to find them again. Okay? What do you want to play? Find the butterflies. That's what we're going to play. Hmm. Join me. Join? What? Join me. And your brother. <laughs> um, and we can play with a lot of people playing with you. I did not read that properly because, you know, I just didn't feel like it. Come on, be a part of me. That sounds really weird. Um, what are you talking about? What part? Sorry, I have to go home. Smart kid, but he doesn't continue this genius thinking. Did I eat? Yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, we did hypnotize him. His eyes changed a different color. They were, like, gray and, like, sleepy. Perfect. Did it say our for first appointment? Not yet. You have to give it to me first. Go over there. That loop is your destination. Go to the noose. I don't want... I don't want... I want to go home! See, his eyes are back to being like reddish color. Catch up. Wait. The keys are gone. Oh. 
There's a note. In the same way. Uh... Oh yeah, I guess in this version I don't get the keys, right? I shoot you instead! You think you can run, but you can't hide. You said you wanted to play hide and seek. Well, I found you. See, it says, Mom, help me, but it's in my pink text. But yet this time it showed his face. And isn't it the scene where you see me laying on the ground? Not him. See? It's me. Okay. My soul is offered instead of his. Because like I said, it was my voice. Plan failed. Mm -hmm. No. Wait. There seems to have a favorable turn. the same code each time, so that never changes. Okay, bye, Mom. You're gonna be glitched. I don't know why that's a part of it. Oh, it's gone. But this is twinkling! July 8th. Nothing. July 9th. Sunny. Today I spoke out. I, sorry. Today I snuck out to play as usual, and then I saw a cute girl with blonde hair by the side of the road. She seems to be about my age. In her hand, she was leading a very lov lovable doggy. I deliberately walked slowly and occasionally glanced back at her. I don't know why, so why did we use these bigger words, but the other sentences prior to the section made no goddamn sense. But anyways, I don't know why, but I really want to be friends with her, talk with her, and play with her. If I had walked over and asked her, "Would you like to be my friend? Would you like to? Bleh, would you like to make friends with me?" Like that sentence. Would you like to be my friend? Would have been better. Would she have agreed? But we can use words like deliberately. Overcast on July 10th. What a bad luck day today. On the way, a flustered big brother knocked off my ice cream ball. So instead it would have been, what a unlucky day would have been the first sentence. On the way, a frustrating boy knocked over my ice cream knocked off one of my ice cream scoops, he's something like that. I haven't had a few... I haven't even had a few bites yet. <sighs> this is the money I saved for a few days. There goes the money I saved... Um, I, there goes the money I saved a few for a few days or something like that. I don't know. I'm so angry. Write it down. But the big brother looked frustrated and scared and searched around. Has he lost money? I don't understand that part. That's the ice cream that we saw on the ground. I have walked the same way many times, but I still haven't met that blonde haired girl by a chance. I have no idea where she lives, how much I want to see her again. Play alone at playing alone at home is so boring and I feel cold lonely. I feel cold laying on the sofa. Mom always comes back very late. I really wish she could spend more time with me. She leaves you home all day like that? That's kinda... She shouldn't have had a kid. 
I guess. Maybe some other things happen. Who knows? How old are you? I'm very, very scared to be home alone. Quiet. Quietly. With some strange noises at times. I always feel like there's an eye staring at me in the darkness. In the dark. Uh, could I be captured by a bad guy like the news on TV? July 12th, he saw me. The weird uncle with red hair who has been changing, who's been standing on the road staring at my house. I wonder if that's the guy that we saw um, in the like black and white tunnel thing. Well, it's not really black and white, but like the darkened tunnel. Maybe he lost the guy who's trying to come out, and he's maybe that's the red-haired kid, and we condemned his soul to that place, and now he's trying to get out, and he's the one who's doing all these strange things. That's just my theory. Throwing it out there. Recently, I have always seen him around through the windows. I'm very scared. Mom, come back soon. Nothing written later. Who is it? Wait a minute. I just realized. This happens once you put the code in. Here. And I didn't put the code in. Is mom stuck? Yeah, this is like mom being stuck there is totally means that I put the code in. Hey. I like how she just completely ignores that. Yes, he's at the door. Let's just quickly step over this body. You saw nothing. Yeah, I wonder if it's him. But there's like some weird force that brings him here. Maybe he's trying to break the loop that we keep putting him into. I'm gonna speed through this until we get to something new. Wow, some cake, right? Cool. I forgot to show you the news. I just want to read this. See, he looks grayed out. Still has red hair. He kind of looks like a zombie version of this kid. Lots of little ghost to use. This is the us that I was talking about. Come on. That's your destination. You just need to do that and then your soul will be free. Free from that body. Oh no, why did you do that? You're supposed to. How dare you run away? Mom. Capture him. Look, it's your brother. Wait, was this there the last time? What is that? A clock? I wonder, can you change the clock? See, there's the infinite loop. The clock is in that same position, but upside down. Tried, kid. It's still my place. <laughs> Bye, kid. Hopefully, it's you, not me this time. Hopefully. Because I didn't sign up for this. Alright, my job here is done. Perfect. It's you, not me, this time. It's exactly what I've wanted. I 
Oh. Oh, that's new. Yo, I started the game up. Okay, and this is the screen that I get to. Help me. I don't want to die like this. I want to see my mom. I feel like they're like different variations of her. What the hell is going on here? I got something. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was me controlling it. Okay, so I got a jar of something. Here, my child. Take this. Let's make a deal. If you are willing to, I can make your wish come true. Let you receive. Then get back to your world and see your mom. But. The condition is, give me your part of it. How about it? I am willing to deal with you. Well. Now, you can walk freely in this world. Go. And get for me and bring it to the tree I will make your wish come true but you can only bring that part nothing else remember well thought so As if I was going to stop playing. Wow. Finally. This is actually new stuff. Oh, a red butterfly. He also came back. Oh. A flicker. Hmm. What's the part that I need? Like I said, okay, if anything else comes new, I will <laughs> keep you posted. You can make her get rid of the cycle. Just need you to make the choice for her. The options she didn't select. Come to the tree to find me. Remember to bring that thing I want. That boy. What should I do next? Well, so it told me about whether or not to skip or not skip important content. So I chose not to skip. So hopefully there is something different I can do at this stage. I'll come back to you if anything changes. So at least now it makes more sense to why she like conned this kid into coming to her house because her life is on the line, obviously, and she needs this kid soul in order for her to live so that's why she persuades him with cake to come on into her house and just chill for a bit and so that way she can figure out how to actually take his soul anyways i'll be back one other thing to note is the crow's not there so i can't save the gameplay so I kind of just have to hope I do the right steps. It also looks like we didn't even bother to answer the door, so let's go. Oh, what the heck? That's so weird! I'm not doing any of this. This is not me. So, 
our appointment. It did say our appointment. No, not yet. You have not given it to me first. So we really do need to kill the kid. Oh! Hand it over. Okay, yeah, I thought so. Damn it! I tried to hand it over and it didn't do anything. So then I tried the no, but I think we're supposed to just keep trying to hand it over. <laughs> Well, hand it over. Hand it over. Oh. I did it. What did I do? Finally. I get it. I know why. I don't know where the hell I was reading. I know you can do it. This stubborn girl finally got a reflect. She has a lot to thank for you. It's a lot to thank you for making everything going so smoothly. I changed every little word that was in that sentence. <laughs> I don't know how you appeared. It seems that you are you were called by her. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Interesting. So, this deal has completed. It's time to, for me to fulfill my promise and make her wish come true. Next, you will proceed for her no matter, no matter better or worse, okay? Maybe we'll meet it sometime. Goodbye. Sounds like a swing. Saving. Hmm. Strange. It's in black and white. Should I go to the swing? Ooh, something doesn't seem right. Oh, I thought that was a crow dude, dude for a second. The time is gone. You can see up there. And then the, the infinity sign is gone too. Let's go upstairs. Still locked. Oh. It had a weird reflection. Oh. Oh. There's the red head kid guy person. Who the hell? I feel like we're gonna die. No matter what. I have a bad feeling about this, guys! <laughs> Can I offer him some cake? Peace offering? Nothing? Okay. It's empty. Same picture. His eyes opened. Because he, since you can see me, it means it has got the soul. This time, it moves in a child. In on children. It moves in on children. Okay, sorry. It seems that its appetite is getting bigger 
and bigger. Listen, now it's the final stage of transfer. Whether this girl can be saved depends on you. Find the exit hidden by it. That is the secret door. Be sure to find it before dawn. This is the only way she can escape. So strange. A little abnormal. Now it doesn't send my body back to the forest anymore. As usual. Now it doesn't send my body back to the forest as usual. It intends to abandon the body. Can it be it has another way to get food? I have an ominous presentation. Don't trust it. Now, I give all the last remaining consciousness to this girl, hoping to invoke the part taken away by it. As long as it gets back to the hole, you can get rid of that guy. Although a few people have been successfully invoked until now, I still hope that this girl can wake up. At least can stop me from making the tragedy happen again. Please. I have no idea what's happening. Okay. Oh. To the heart of the soul. I have to hurry up and hope this time uh, will go well. Okay. The fines. When taking her soul away, they didn't miss tick. Oh, I guess the thing behind there is the soul. If not removing these, her souls will fall asleep forever. Even if I go to fill her lost soul, it's useless. Obviously, we must abandon me. We must abandon me and her together. A sinister guy. Okay. I will not give up. I have to find another light and entangled by the vines and get them back. There is a faint light after being lit up. You can try to follow this light. It must be the direction of the next light. Okay. Wow, this game's a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. This is like a whole other game, too. Shift to run. Be careful of those of those guys. Don't be caught by them. Come on, I can do it. Oh, it's pretty easy. Um. The problem is, I don't know where the hell I'm supposed to be going. That over there looked like a dead end. Oh. That was dumb. I died. Okay. 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 I was... <laughs> so now my th computer thinks there's like a sticky key problem. Perfect. If I just take my time... I think down here is just like a dead end, right? Perfect. Nice, another one. The things chasing me has also disappeared. It seems as if they are f afraid of this light. Fortunately, their numbers is not very large. Good, continue. 
Okay. So, it seems that I just need to find these things. How do I get there? Oh. Okay. Well, there's a lot more to this game than I really thought. I thought it was just going to be the same thing. <laughs> I was ready to say goodbye to you guys. <laughs> well, um... Hopefully I don't die. Stupidly. I feel like going down is probably the better bet. I'm trying not to use the shift button because my computer thinks it's like a sticky key situation. Um, nothing up there. Nothing. Uh, do you guys- oh, there it is. Perfect. Ah, this is like child's play right now. <laughs> so easy. <gasps> really thrilling. God dang it. It seems that their numbers is slowly increasing. Yeah, I noticed that. I have to step fast and look forward. Keep going. I mean, I think we're doing great. I have, I can't even press the shift button without my computer making weird noises. I don't even know where I'm going. <gasps> the road is blocked. Broken. No! No way to get back. That's not good. Guess we're stuck this way. We're engulfed in the darkness. <laughs> that startled me. This way. Oh gosh, this is a real labyrinth. Ooh, I had to use it. Okay, I think that's good. I think we're in the clear. Perfect. What does that mean? <gasps> ah. There was a f sudden flash. What happened? I don't know. I would really like to fix the sticky key situation on my computer. Ow. Woo! Oh god! 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 <laughs> I don't like that. Whew. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Oh my lanta! Jesus! Z! <sighs> <laughs> almost forgot what button. Woo! 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 I'm scary. <laughs> if if I still had a heart a heartbeat, I definitely couldn't be stimulated like this. Perfect. Everything's brightened up. It seems to be the last one. I did it! Great! Great. Don't get too excited, I still have to find her. It may take more time, so hurry up. Guess we're going this way. An initial at the door. I wasn't going to talk about, about the hidden exit. But, maybe this is too selfish, so I decided to tell you. You were going to keep secrets from me? What? There was a hidden exit and he was not going to tell me? But the only chance to stop the devil and, complete and compete against it is her. However, the price may bring her up and down and suffer again and suffering again. If you choose to find that door, take her out. Then, if I can successfully awaken her soul... Then you can get her out of the devil's space. She can fly to heaven with her own consciousness instead of floating in the void. It's up to you. Find that door and get her out. Or not to find. Once back there, follow them. Wait, so if I don't set her free... 
She, uh, what happens to her? Complete the final transfer. I need her to accomplish this mission. Now this is the great opportunity. If missing this one, you may be stuck here forever. And those trapped souls. Now only you and that devil can control her. After finding that girl, I will pull out the line left by it. It can't manipulate her. The clue about the hidden door. I only say it once, so remember. It seems to be hidden in the opposite world. It's like the mirror probably being there. Finally, I want to ask a favor of you. Can you accept a small request from me? Thank you. But I'm not sure if you will ever meet. If you can meet my wife in the outside world, please tell her for me. Sorry. You have a wife? You look like you're like maybe 20. Oh, this dude again. Is it broken? Finally. I found you. Hope it works this time. God damn it. It hurts. How can't I get through? How come I can't get through? Damn it. It must be it, that bastard. So close. Just watch like this. I'm not recoiling it. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> Get out of the way! <sighs> One last running strike. Bust through that wall. Come on, man, you can do this. What's going on? Oh, damn. I can't move. It's not letting me do anything. The blonde chick. Why are you standing at the door? Why don't you do anything? Didn't you say that you would play with me? Come on. Oh. She's finally in my house with the doggy. Yay! Finally. Be polite. Don't run around. Oh, poppers. Well, that lasted very short timing. Come here. Poppers, wait. Oh, look at him. So tiny. There's still time to play. What are we going to do? I don't know. Well, I want to visit your pretty room. How about going to your room? All right. If you don't speak, you mean yes. <laughs> Let's go. I can't wait. I guess we can't talk. Your room is so cute. It's like a sweet strawberry cake. I like it. The small bed is soft. So comfortable. May I have a look at your drawers? Silence means yes. Thank you. <laughs> Wow, there's a lot of white paper in your drawers. Why don't we paint with these papers? Ah, by the way, I almost forgot. Get some more colored crayons. Perfect. Start painting. She's just like... Why are you standing there? Come over and paint with me. 
start painting. What if this wasn't the right answer? What should I paint? Well, I have it. Uh, it's a green cottage. Okay. There's a little ghost. Ghosty goo. Uh, what is it doing here? Exert my imagination to make it move. Oh no, there's a fox. Oh, Mr. Fox is lying on the ground. Is he sleeping? He kind of looks dead. It's not okay, Mr. Fox. It's so cold on the ground. He'll catch a cold. I have to ask him to get up. This is so random. Oh, he's alive. That's great. He woke up. Are we inside of him? Do we possess his body? So what will Mr. Fox do next? Uh, Mr. Fox is going out to play. He says he can't wait. Alright, she is quite the imagination. We're totally possessing him. Oh, there's a sad kitty by the road. It looks as if it needs help. The warm-hearted Mr. Fox decided to go and help him. In a whole show here. Oh, Mr. Fox, please help me. My doll was taken away by an evil dark bird. That dark bird flew into the barn and could go in and help me get the doll out. I dare not go in fear of the dark. Please. The warm hearted Mr. Fox says no matter no problem. Consider it done. I will help you get the doll out. Thank you, Mr. Fox. The barn, you just go along the road and see it. He totally is dead. Oh my crow! The doll, doll, with a strange smell. Take it back to Miss. Take it. <laughs> Door's gonna close. Thought so. Oops. What is that sound? Only the sound of. It's weird. When did this button appear here? Try to press it down? I feel like any decision, I have to like, survey it. Is it gonna be a good one to make? Oh, the door is open, great. Sounds like it's only open for a short time period. <gasps> Are we on a conveyor belt? Wow. Jesus. I didn't expect that to happen. This to happen. Poor Mr. Kitty was hit. Who will come to save him? This game is violent. Oh, we got another soul. Huh. Huh. <laughs> okay. Mr. Kitty was taken to the mysterious place by the white bird man. Maybe it's all happened so happened. Maybe it all happened so fast. Mr. Kitty has no idea that he has died. Birdman told Mr. Kitty. As long as he gives the birdman a gift, 
his own gift. Birdman will fulfill any Miss Kitty's wishes. Miss Kitty replies, Really? That's so basically us. Birdman didn't answer him. Mr. Kitty thought for a while. He says he wants his doll back. It is an important friend. Birdman says, no problem. Now, go and bring your gift to that special tree. Once I get your gift, I will give the doll to you. Mr. Kitty agrees. Oh wow, there is so many layers of this game. And hidden styles. Wow, suddenly Mr. Kitty finds himself in a forest. He looks around and finds that next to him was the gift he was going to give to Mr. Birdman. An orange gift. The fox? Now Mr. Kitty is going to bring his gift over to Mr. Birdman's. Just go straight to the left and you'll be there. But the overgrown weeds block the way. Can't get there. It seems that Mr. Kitty has to pass with the gift while carrying, clearing the weeds. Let's help Mr. Kitty. Wow, press A to start the puzzle. Shift run. How do I... Oh, so we're pushing him. Okay. Okay. So we have to push the fox. Because he's the gift. All the way to the end. Let's go, Mr. Fax. Oh, shit. That was dumb. No! <laughs> I did all that work and I screwed myself over. This button... clear it the first time because if I push this up here I can't move him let's just clear the path completely so we can get him through um, and then maybe that would save us a headache um, if I push this, I'm gonna push this one up. And then this one. Hmm. I feel like we're gonna need this space to be cleared. So the question is, do I push this one down or do I push it up? I'm gonna push it down. Okay. If I get him here, and then I push him here, you pretty much just need him to go straight. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, keep moving, keep moving, get your fat bum going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. I need you to go all the way through, Mr. Fox. There's a number, like 195 something. 
Again? Oh, my Lanta. Okay, so if we, okay, so this one we're just gonna push him up and then push him all the way here and then use the rock, bring him down to about here. So then we need to clear these spots. Uh, hiya. There is Houston. I think we have a problem. Cause then we get him here and then he needs to go down and then we push him here, here. He goes up. We can go back behind him, push him here, here. He goes down one. We need to move this bush, so if you push this bush down, it's fine. Uh, and then this would be a straight way. And we push this um, here. one down and then this oh shit oh wait that that's fine right yeah I think that can work let's try this see if my brain functions do I do good <laughs> let's go let's go let's go I'm your um Let's do one more push. Okay. Down by one, right? Yeah. And then we push you here. Oh, that was even easier. I was making a big deal for nothing. See, that looks like a number up there. It looks like 1955. Five. I don't know if that was intentional to make it look like a number. I honestly kind of forget what we're supposed to be doing here. This girl has a lot of artistic work so she's doing like there's a hand or a bit there you go that's what you wanted this is my doll you are back my doll is back mr. kitty said happily are you sure Look, another door. Oh, and you're... Where are you going? That doesn't look like your doll from before. Mr. Kitty, don't go. You shouldn't do it. Oh, you really have to. We already sold his, someone, our other friend's soul, but I mean, I'm pretty sure the fox was dead. Do you notice the same coloring? The red fox, the pink cat, hit the same thing. We're stuck on a leash. What? This looks like a fox tail. The heck is that? Are we in a house again? What's this blonde girl? Is she really a good person? Mr. Fox is laying on the ground. Is he sleeping? It's not okay, Mr. Fox. It's so cold on the ground, he will catch a cold. Welcome back to the loop once more. Ah! Painting's finished. This time, the traveler's story of the little ghost. I'm exhausted. I feel so numb laying prone so long. Wow, you use a word like that? Come on, let's go outside. Let's go. She's evil! <laughs> I thought the pink haired girl was evil. What's the matter? Clearly she's the evil one. Don't you want to play with me? No. I don't trust you. She's gonna push me. Let's go. Yep. Wow, it's a swing. Great. 
Are you going to turn it into a noose? I only invited you here because I wanted to play with your dog. Let's play in the swing. You come to the back and push me. I guess. She's doing that on her own. It's really fun. I know, swings are my favorites. That is the best part of the park. I remember the last time I played on the swing was with an older woman. Is that your mom? Miss her a little bit. Ha! <laughs> Madame, are you still there? Oh, I forgot. You can't speak intuitively like you. What? It's getting pinker. Is the sun setting? Changing color. You want to leave here now? Then go to the door the red haired uncle mentioned to you. You know, Nissan? I heard the conversation between you and that person. Tell you quietly. You mustn't believe what he said. I don't believe you. Because he's a liar. I don't trust you. He and that black guy are together. Black haired guy, you mean? I deliberately pretended to be a very pitiful. I deliberately pretended to be very pitiful to deceive you, make you believe uh, those weird words he said. But the actual purpose is to s seduce you into a deeper place. Uh, you mustn't believe him. I've been stuck here for a long time. That's fine, you can stay here. And I have so many people cheating by him. I guess you have already met those victims. They are all asleep in heavily here. Fortunately, I found I hid myself at that time and then survived. I heard him say that the black guy intended to d discard him. I think it's prom I think it's promised that he will be eaten. That's why he wants to fill a scapegoat to replace him. Then make up those words to let you in that guy's mouth. Mm hmm. You must believe me. Don't look for that door. Just stay here and play with me. Will you? I'm no longer alone. Can I leave? I don't know your name yet. And you can't talk intuitively. It's purple now? According to my practice, give you a name. Hmm. You look pink. Tender. Very cute. So, call you... It's dark purple now. Sweet potato. What? <laughs> it's nice. No, it's not. The hell? <laughs> Hi, little sweet potato. Do you like the new name I gave you? Hell no! It's turning dark blue now. What name have I given others before? Remember to have German frog, cheese, and black tea. I like black tea better. Too many. Stop thinking. Kids, let's eat. Well's that? Come on, coming. Let's go, sweet potato. Let's go eat. What's happening? Come eat. Don't make it melt. Today, here is a delicious ice cream feast. Oh, so great. 
Ice cream. Oh, it's the dog. I was like, what is that thing on the bottom corner? Are you happy, little sweet potato? How do you know she gave me that stupid name? Enjoy yourself. Mom has to go back to the room for a break. Touches the head. What's in your room? I want to know. Oh my god, I've been playing this for like an hour. <laughs> Actually, more than. Sit down and eat. But I don't want to. I want to leave. Dog is eating. Same photo. Okay, sorry, I had to check these things. I don't mind if I do. Start. Oh. Playing a little mini game now. Ah, oh, I always miss the S. What? I pressed it! Okay, that time I was like really slow. Okay. You son on a beach. Okay. That's great! Delicious! Uh huh. Oh, oops. I didn't know we were still going. Uh huh. What? What's that taste? I don't know, you tell me. A kind of dreamy feeling. It's like a fantastic fantasy taste. A fantastic taste. Hey, what? Oops, that was way too early. <sighs> oh, what? Okay. This game officially is not wanting to end. Silky and sweet. I don't feel any stomach aches after eating. That's great. It's so delicious. And he made a great ice cream. Full, full. Why didn't you eat a bit? Is your stomach aching or are you not hungry at all? Okay, I will treat as if you have finished it. Wow, nothing left. Eat more than I. Come on, let's go outside to exercise. Go, go! What is happening? What is going on? Let's play the last game! This game is... Hide and Seek. You play as the ghost, and I'll hide myself. You stand under the tree and count. Come. And catch me on the count of ten. Three, two, one, go! Sorry. What if I just leave? Aw, oh, darn it. They saw through my plan! Nothing. Dog is sleeping. What is this? I see her. We're just not gonna talk about that? You found me! Doesn't count. I need to go somewhere else. Just because you lost. Oh, the little feety prince is like her footprints. 
That doesn't count. I need to go somewhere else. Okay. I like the music. Based on how she was already on the ground floor, she's probably upstairs. Oh, the crow's taking the little red-haired... Oh, okay. So, if you can see in the corner by the trees, there's the fox. And then the crow's taking another red-haired person. There's something different about that one. Is that supposed to be the toy? I guess so. What the hell was that? What was he doing? She hid really well. Oh, she's outside. <laughs> you found me. Okay, I give up. You win. <sighs> I'm so sleepy. I don't want to play anymore. It's too late. Let's go to the room and go to bed. Let's go. Bro, well, this is so long! <gasps> Come on. Come over and sleep with me. Wait a moment. She's tired doesn't mean that I'm tired. Ah, oh, damn it, I have to actually go to sleep. Okay. Oh. She's like happy. Bye. What do you mean bye? Good night. Close your eyes. Did she change? I blinked at that time. What is that? Is that a key? What is that? Time is running out? What does this mean? What's going on? Oh. Yo, he has a gun. Beside him. To, like really pay attention if I was actually here in the game or in real life. Police! Don't move! Put your hands up! Did you hear me? <laughs> Apprehended. Behave yourself! This man looks a little familiar. He looks like a famous killer wanted five years ago. Are you sure it's him? Not sure, just my sense. Says. Take him back and question first. It's a pity, still a kid. Isn't that the brother? She's already died. So cruel. This girl! Isn't that the one I ran into before? That's what I was saying! Isn't that the brother? If only I could have... What happened then? Leave the rest to you. Well... You go. Go! Why not go? Don't play tricks. Behave yourself. Go! Why does he look like a zombie, though?
get in. You sure you want to go in the back seat? Oh, I thought I was going to move, but no. And getting in. Yo, what is going on? See, he looks like a zombie. Report. We have captured... We have caught a killer in an, a community. We're taking him back to the police office now. Police station now. It would have been better. The dead was a little girl. The cause of death is presumed to be gunshot to the head. The appearance of the killer fits really well with the serial killer wanted a few years ago. Right. Both have a strand of red hair, stained with blood all over the body. When I arrived at the scene, he stood motionless in front of the dead body. No resistance at all. But that's really weird. We have pursued him for many years, or for so many years, and there are no clues at all. No trace of him can be found. Sorry, just like disappearing. Then he appeared inexplicably somewhere and killed someone, but disappeared again. However, if he is really that serial killer, this is too easy. This killer is too... Cunning. That's too easy. I feel like dreaming. What? I feel like I'm dreaming is what he meant to say. But the appearance of the killer is a little strange. Which makes me feel uncomfortable. His eyes rather dull. Behaving abnormally. And when I touch his body, it feels a chill. I feel felt a chill. Oh my god, that actually startled me because I was trying to focus on what it said. <laughs> and I wasn't expecting a sound. Okay. There's a car accident. What is that? Is that a bottle? I'm a genie in a bottle. Just kidding, he's a dead man. Okay, oh, okay, okay, we we're seeing his hand. Wow, this is really, really slow. I'll just move over slightly. See his hand. Oh, his finger's moving. <laughs> 